Hey guys, this is Tyler with Tyler Dragon Tarot, and Libra, it is your turn for the Halloween raid. So Libra, let's see what is going on with you. Thank you guys for the likes and the subscribes, I appreciate it so much. Um, oh, and the comments. Um, so hopefully these messages are resonating with at least some of you. Um, let's see what I get for Libra this time. So, come on, Halloween deck. What do we got for the Libras? Oh, oh, we got, we got one. We got two. Should I take two? Yeah. All right, we got the seven events and strength. So, so this card, it kind of feels like your heart isn't glowing as strong as it should you're confused um and it's like your spirit guide's trying to help you it's like hey over here in the corner it's like he's talking to him um you got what these guys in between are all just like what are we doing i don't even know um this is about the passion and desire, by the way. And then this guy is, like, pointing up at the sky or at this house. And he's like, hey, we should go here. I feel like you know what you should do. But with this card coming out with strength, I feel like you're the lion in this. Lions are usually brave and strong and just, they're just like... Man, have you seen them at the zoo? They're just like, I don't care. Look at me. What What you want? Like, they don't give a shit. But this lion, he's like the cowardly lion from the Wizard of Oz. I don't... Strength isn't the usual strength in this deck for some reason. And, uh... I mean, it... I always focus on lion, but the girl is pretty brave just going into a lion's mouth, but that lion's obviously scared. The lion's the scared one, and I feel like you're the lion. You need to be the girl who's not afraid to go into a lion's mouth. Um, so, let's see. Kind of hearing, like, I'm going to say jump in, but I'm kind of hearing you need to fight for something. Um, there is something you need to fight for, Libra. You're scared to fight for it. You need to fight for it. <sighs> okay, you got the Ace of Bats. I feel like you're going to come to the realization that you need to fight for it. Like, it's just going to hit you like, oh, shit. Um, and since you've been this cowardly lion over here, like, all right. Well, you're going to go charging in, like, the, with passion about this, like the Knight of Imps. You're going to go fast. See how this horse is just blowing smoke out of his nose? Um, I feel like... You realize, oh, shit. Like, you finally realize whatever you were confused about and your passion. There's a sense of urgency in this card to me. And you're just like, oh, shit. I, I can't believe, like, you were confused about what you were passionate about before. Then, and you were scared. I feel like you were scared to admit it. Maybe you were scared to admit you were wrong, because that just popped in my head. Um, that just popped in my head. You were scared to admit that you were wrong, Libra. And a lot of us can't admit that. But something's going to make you realize, oh, shit, I was wrong. And you're going to go charging in. You're going to, mm, you're going to go charging in. And you're just going to be like... Uh, you're gonna it's gonna be all you can see all your passion is gonna go towards it you're just gonna be blazing just whoosh, it's gonna be on fire and 
kind of scared to draw the next card because this kind of seems like it's an urgent situation. Um, oh, goodness, it popped out. I'm nervous for you. <laughs> Okay, we got the five of bats. Okay. Okay, there's some anger in this card. You know, there's this little guy in a cop. Yeah, this guy stole. This guy stole candy from this kid. And. I kind of feel like this is the person that you realize there's a sense of urgency. I feel like you, you feel like the passion went away or you were confused about the passion. So it seems like there's been a lot of breakups lately. So I'm getting that you might have broke up with this person. Then you might have started realizing, oh, maybe I shouldn't have done that, but you were scared to do it. Now you're getting this message like, yeah, 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 that was that. was That, that was my person. Oh, shit. And you're going to go blazing in. And Libra, this might not be easy because I think this is how they view you. You stole their candy. They're, they're a kid on Halloween. Um crying, being, and someone's consoling them. Um, hell, your spirit guide looks pissed at you. Like, why did you do that? Um, you got a mask on. I'm hearing, like, they don't recognize you because you stole their candy. You, they don't recognize you with that mask on. I, I'm getting betrayal. Um, Oh, goodness, Libra, I'm sorry. This is just, this is what is popping out of my head. And I, I'm sorry. Um, so, I'm going to have to draw more cards. Like, this is what you're going to deal with. I feel like you're going to come in with the Knight of Imps anyway. But this is what you're going to deal with. I feel like this is how they're seeing you. I mean, obviously, we see how. Um, so you're going to have to come in. I'm feeling like you're going to have to come in with some honesty. Um, you're. The high priestess. Okay. Okay, I'm hearing you might be coming in a little fast. And you really need to think about your offer before you bring it to them. Because they're more intuitive or they're trusting their intuition more than they used to be. So if you bring them shit, they're going to see shit. Um, sorry to be so blunt, but that's the message I'm getting, and I will not edit myself. So I hope I don't offend anyone. But when I get the message, you're going to get the message. And sometimes it's not always a good message, and you need to be prepared to hear it. Um, so... I'm sorry, Libra, but don't offer them crap because they're going to see crap if you offer them crap. If you're going to come in and give an offer, you better give it all you got and you better, this better actually be what you want. It seems like it is from the cards and it seems like, but it does seem like you're going to be rushing in. You better... I'm just saying, I, I'm hearing you got to come clean. You got things to come clean about. You, there's going to be a lot of effort that you're going to have to put in 
and you know it's funny I'm hearing things I've been telling you to really think about it and you got the hermit so I, I feel like this is there go ahead go in guns blazing but have think about it for a second because you're really going to have to make it up to this person, whoever you hurt, because whoever you cross, because they're going to know now. They're on their guard, and they will know if you are not. I feel like you're going to be coming to them like you, you've changed, um, but you might... You're going to have to let your walls down is what I'm hearing. You are going to have to let your walls down for them to let their walls down because they're going to be guarded and their intuition's going to know. Their intuition's going to know if you're half-assing it. And if you half-ass it, they will not take you back. Um, sorry to get so real with you, Libra, but that is the message. And I hope it vibes with some of you. Um, well... Have a good Halloween, Libra. I really hope whoever this message is for gets it because um, it sounds like you need it. Well, anyway, thank you guys for watching.